Barbarian, new horror film out on Disney+, Plus, starring Georgina Campbell, Bill Skarsgård and Justin Long. Came out of nowhere and blew me away. Uh, potentially my favorite horror film of the year, uh, outside of maybe Nope. Uh, the story setup is extremely simple. A young woman arrives in a rundown, dangerous part of Detroit in the middle of a rainy night, where her rented house, which she rented via Airbnb, is located. She goes there, there are no keys in the little box on the porch, she tries calling the administrators, nobody's picking up, it's looking desperate, but then it turns out someone is inside the house. She bangs on the door, thinking it's someone from the administration, but it turns out it's a young man who claims to also have reserved the same house through a different website. They compare the reservations on their phones, looks legit, a mistaken double booking, the man then offers the lady to come inside and stay the night. Uh, one of them will take the bed, the other the couch. She is initially very suspicious because this looks shady as shit, but then she ends up taking the offer and going inside. That's as much as I'm saying, because I don't want to spoil things, but believe me when I tell you, the movie does not end up where you think it will go. It has probably three or four different points where a plot twist happened and I went, what the fuck is going on here? It's amazing in the way it really anticipates your expectations and goes sort of against them. I think that the performances are very good, so is the writing. Uh, on the one hand, the film is pretty concise and efficient, uh, it doesn't waste time over explaining everything and it's paced very well, which helps make it as tense as it is. And on the other hand, it constantly... Come away. It constantly puts characters in um, situations where we, the audience, know that they should turn around and run, and, and they have that same thought in their heads as well, but they don't, but they have reasons why they don't. It, it, it's explained why they do the things they do. Uh, and yet, you know, some of them are better explanations, some of them are worse, but I never felt that anyone is doing anything just for the sake of the plot. Uh, the motivations are clear and the decisions, even the wrong ones, make sense. It's also a great mix of tension, uh, grotesque horror and sort of dark humor. Uh, I like the music and the sort of claustrophobic cinematography. I also like how the movie touches on the sort of degradation of American cities, particularly Detroit, in a way, you know, showing a total downfall of the American dream sold in, in the decades past. Uh, also, it's pretty interesting in exploring how a man and a woman uh, presented with a similar situation behave completely differently, which the movie even directly comments on uh, through dialogue, uh, how a situation that instills paralyzing fear in a lady can just be an afternoon for a guy and he won't think twice about it. Uh, anyway, it's clever, it's well-made, unpredictable and properly tense and scary. Great horror film.